Hi Aquarius, welcome to your reading Aquarius. In this, in this reading we'll be focusing on your person. We will take a look at your person's feelings, their intentions, their actions towards you. We will take a look at your connection and we will pull some oracle cards for you, for your person and for your connection as well. So let's take a look Aquarius. With whom we are connecting today for Aquarius please. Aquarius, Aquarius's person, could you please show Aquarius's person. Could you please show Aquarius's person? <coughs> Could you please show Aquarius's person? We have a six of cups, Aquarius, the four. We have a knight of swords. show Aquarius's person please we have ten of wands and we have queen of wands uh, queen of cups sorry at the bottom of the deck we have ace of wands Aquarius for your person okay so Aquarius you might be dealing with another Aquarius I have strong Aries as well and also um, water sign Scorpio Pisces Cancer this person is very passionate about you Aquarius they they want to do something they are if they feel very creative they want to communicate they want to talk to you they want to be near you with the six of cups to the full to the knight of swords this person feels an urge to come forward and offer you a new beginning with the Six of Cups opening this mini spread, Aquarius, I feel that uh, we are connecting here from someone from your past. It might be your ex, because Six of Cups is the energy of the past. This is someone who feels a strong soul connection with you, with whom you might have had a um, long history, with whom you have known for some time. With the Six of Cups, this person wants to come back. They want to talk about the situation. They want to present themselves from this kind of softer side uh, so you can expect if this person will show up and it seems that they do want to do that um, they will present themselves from the from this more affectionate side they will be um, I feel very generous with their feelings they want to talk with the Knight of Swords they're rushing in they feel that it's the, the it's the right time It's this time I need to do it and I really do want to have this new beginning with Aquarius. This is what I'm getting with these cards. Ten of Wands, Queen of Cups. They are very burdened. They are burdened by their emotions. This person is very emotional at the moment when it comes to you, Aquarius. I feel that they are... that they don't really know what to do in general with these emotions because Ten of Wands to the Queen of Cups, it shows that this person feels really strongly about you but for some reason um maybe they 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 have some sort of blockage to express these feelings or circumstances are not quite right there are some obstacles on the way maybe even in this person's environment we'll take a look at this in a minute or even within them they feel blocked ten of wands is this energy of being very exhausted stressed overwhelmed and we have a Queen of Cups, which represents emotions. This person is very overwhelmed by their emotions. And they feel that they do need to talk. They want to take initiative. They, I feel this person is trying to manifest you, trying to some sort of um, attract you. You know, kind of a, on a, some sort of telepathic connection. This I've, Maybe you have with this person or share but they do want to manifest you, they want to take initiative, they feel very creative and there is this energy of Knight of Swords, very kind of this, this urge that I need to talk to Aquarius about the situation because I want to be with Aquarius or I want to be given another chance. Okay, well, let's take a look at your connection with this person, Aquarius. Let's see. 
we have a, a Knight of Cups could you please show me okay eight of Pentacles and we have two of Wands okay at the bottom of the deck we have a five of cups overall energy represented by the five of cups Aquarius for your connection mean, uh, signifies that both of the parties maybe at the moment are not fully satisfied there is um, this energy of regret of sadness of, of pain of emotional pain is this energy of um, just being unhappy I feel that something happened between the two of you with the five of cups because this is not this is quite challenging energy we can see looking at the card that this person it's not happy and um, I feel that there are some regrets on your side we have a knight of cups I feel Aquarius that when I look at those cards and, I, and when I look at your energy I feel with the knight of cups that some of you, you you might be open for communication with this person or to kind of you know if they come forward and they give you some sort of offer you you would be open to 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 consider it because i feel aquarius with this nine of cups knight of cups that you do have some feelings for this person it might be feelings of sentiment or you might be simply sometimes momentarily miss miss you know miss this person you might be missing this person i should say but i feel for some of you aquarius you you might be willing to talk to this person, to meet up, to see how things will develop between the two of you. Mutual energy with the eight is the Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles shows that there is a room that certain things can't work out between the two of you. However, uh, effort and hard work is needed in order to achieve this goal. Nevertheless, I strongly feel with this Eight of Pentacles as a mutual energy, if both parties are willing to compromise and work on the situation, a positive re result can be achieved between the two of you. Okay, so please take it as it resonates, Aquarius. Aquarius, please uh, take a note that we are connecting with collective energy, so there will be many scenarios, okay? And cross watches for Aquarius, you are very much welcome, but things might be played, you know, might be playing from your perspective, so the roles can be switched. It might be something that, that Aquarius did to you. Okay. With the two of wands, Aquarius for your person, this person is planning, they are waiting, they are strategizing, and I feel they are observing. They are observing you somewhere from afar. It might be, you know, internet, they might be looking at your stories, but I feel this person is very much focused on, uh, on you with the two of wands, but there is but there is this energy of planning, planning, waiting, planning, strategizing, how to do it, what to do, what would be best, how I should approach Aquarius. Nevertheless, the five of cups as a mutual, as, a, as an overall energy for your connection is that something happened between the two of you. Someone felt, maybe even both of you felt, um, just sad and there is this kind of energy of is everything lost is there any chance to kind of um rec is there any room for reconciliation okay or to make things better maybe for some of you maybe even this person might be thinking i don't know if aquarius still is in love with me because a day uh, on this side, they are very overwhelmed by those emotions. Mm, we'll see. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at your person's energy, Aquarius. But with the Five of Cups, there is this kind of energy of sadness. And um, something here didn't work, wor work out between the two of you. And this is kind of a overall energy for your connection however spirit is saying that there is a room for improvement with the eight of pentacles nevertheless both of the parties have to kind of find this compromise and willingness to 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 work to give this um, to give equally into the connection okay so let's take a look 
Aquarius. Could you please show Aquarius's person's energy, please? Aquarius's person's energy, please. We have Aquarius separation, mm -hmm. Phoenix, and we have palm tree. Okay. So this energy of sadness represented by the five of cups is, 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 is present here, especially in your person's energy at the moment. We have sadness missing you, thinking about you, unsure about the future. This person is missing you, Aquarius. They are thinking about you. That's what I was getting with the two of wands, observing, strategizing, planning. Five of Cups, yes, there is the sadness caused by a separation. Something didn't work out between the two of you. And this person is very overwhelmed by the, by the, by the strength of the emotion, how intense those emotions are. And I feel certain things are playing on their mind. We have the Phoenix, Rekindle, Grove, transformation and then we have stability security growth again this is the thing Aquarius that eight of Pentacles uh, shown right here in the middle as a mutual energy for you and your person it's showing that indeed this person I feel that um, something changed with within them also maybe they experienced some sort of change major change in their life. I feel that certain things um, made this person um, reevaluate this connection and their life in general. Therefore, I strongly feel here that uh, this person is ongoing in some sort of transformation. There is a transition. And I also feel that they do want to come back to have a new beginning. With the Phoenix, things are changing. It's like a rising from the ashes. Again, this energy from the past wants to resurface again. This person wants to have another chance with you, Aquarius. With the palm tree, they want to bring stability. They want to bring, they want this um, connection to be secure because they see the growth. They see, um, I feel Aquarius that you gave this person lots of love but also this kind of um, energy of stability. And I feel that at the moment, this person is missing it. Okay, let's see Aquarius, your energy. Could you please show me Aquarius's energy? We have golden mirror. And we have mirror. So mirror is quite uh, significant, it's coming forward. Okay, we have self-absorbed, narcissist, one-sided, relationship, love bone, boning, mirroring each other, old wounds. Hmm, interesting. So Aquarius, the thing is that during this connection, you might felt that this person had some sort of all kind of exposed some sort of uh, narcissistic traits. Maybe they came forward. I don't see this energy here. I need to be very honest with you. But I'm seeing that you might see this person as someone who is self-focused, very self-absorbed, very um, self-centered. Okay. And your impression of this connection is that it was a one-sided relationship. It wouldn't surprise me. We have a five of cups at the end of the, of the day here and separation. So something indeed didn't work out. But when I see at the moment, when I'm looking at them, you know, now in, day, in their energy, I feel that this person, it's, it's something it's changing in their life or and within them. Therefore, I don't see this narcissistic um, tendencies so far let's say it that way however this is your energy so you might be seeing this person you might be saying this person has been nothing than hard work and it and it could and, and you might be right because we do have this ten of wands maybe they indeed 
burden you with their personality or the way they were conducting themselves during your connection. But with the Ten of Wands, I also see that this person is very overwhelmed with the emotions. There is some sort of understanding coming forward. Maybe at the time it wasn't present, this, 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 you know. Maybe they were completely clueless and they made a mistake. Therefore, we, we have in your energy, Aquarius, that, that you, might, you might see them as someone who is very selfish. And you might felt that during this connection, indeed, it was a one-sided relationship. And this person was just trying to um, even manipulate you at, at, in, a, in a certain degree. Mirroring each other. We have a mirror. Mirror Again, this is quite interesting because we have a golden mirror and we have a mirror. So indeed, yes, it might be a case that you saw that this person was just focused on their own reflection. They were the most important for themselves and somehow you kind of were put on a second uh, plan. I also feel, Aquarius, that you might see this person as someone who is very wounded, who is conditioned by their past. And that's why all those wounds and those issues, they, they somehow, um, yes, they were, they, maybe they mirrored or kind of the reflection of those wounds or their issues were present in your connection. I hope it makes sense, Aquarius. <laughs> yes, makes sense, absolutely. They want to talk. <laughs> Let's take a look, Aquarius. Let's take a look um, at your connection. Let's pull some more mess messages of love for you and for your connection. For some of you Aquarius, you don't have a um, good opinion about this person. You don't. But it doesn't mean that you, you don't have feelings for them. Let's take a look. Could you please show me Aquarius's, pers uh, Aquarius's connection please with that person? With this person. We have patience and we have intuition. Okay, and at the bottom of the deck we have obsession. Someone is obsessing. It wouldn't surprise me, Aquarius, that this is, it's this person's energy because they are very overwhelmed by their emotions at the moment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This person with these cards and with an obsession card, maybe, you know, you see, you experience during this connection that they were very possessive, very jealous, obsessing. I tell you one thing, Aquarius, that this person might be obsessing over you. I feel they are thinking very, 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 just nonstop, 24 seven about, you know, about you with the patience and intuition. Listen to your intuition, Aquarius, because at this time, I feel that your intuition is spot on. That's what, that's what spirit is saying. It says you already know the answers you seek. And with the patience card, something has to unfold in a divine timing. I feel, Aquarius, that it is quite important for this person to, to, to go through this major transformation. Because during this transformation and this separation, this per person is realizing how much, what sort of mistakes they made. And that they are indeed, um, ha they, they have a very strong feelings for you. This is something that they had to go through and it, I feel it's not easy for them, but it is necessary. Let's take a look. What this person would like to uh, confess to you, Aquarius? Let's see. What they would like to confess to you, Aquarius? We have, I am lost without you. And at the bottom of the deck we have, I want to start over. Absolutely. With the full card, with the Phoenix card, this person wants to have another chance. They want to start over. They want to come back. I am lost without you. 
they are very lonely they are very lonely Aquarius they feel um, they feel um, this lack of, 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 of your love of your care you being ver very nurturing towards this person they are missing you a lot Aquarius let's take a look at your person's feelings Aquarius let's see could you please show me okay <sighs> let's see Aquarius we have a five of Pentacles they are lost without you absolutely this is exactly what the five of Pentacles represents low being left out in the cold with no support being lonely missing you Aquarius a so temperance ace of wands so Aquarius you might be dealing with Sagittarius and excuse me one card fell down and we have this ace of swords they want to talk Aquarius in their feelings this person it's very emotional at the bottom of the deck we have the two of cups this person is in love with you Aquarius sorry <laughs> I'm with you this person is in love with you Aquarius with the two of cups for someone else's emotions it's love it's wanting to be together wanting to share everything good that is happening in someone else's life it's 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 affection it's it's love they love you they want to be with you with the five of pentacles this person feels lonely if you have you know if you if you think that if this person is presenting themselves as they are doing okay no deeply inside and i feel behind the closed doors that the reality is different this person is very unhappy and they are under they are going through some sort of really difficult transformation but uh, it is done I feel they have to they have to go through it in order to realize certain things about their personality about their life and about how they how what it's important really with the temperance ace of wands ace of swords they want to reconcile the temperance it's you see she is holding as well to chalices and we have those two chalices sh on this card to show that these people want to share with each other this is a card temperance is again this divine timing card but also a card of reconciliation they want to reconcile with you aquarius they want to come forward two aces they feel very passionate about it and they want to talk they want to talk and they feel that they have to explain themselves because they feel that you are their person Aquarius very strong energy from someone from your past who wants to come forward and reconcile with you Aquarius let's take a look at your person's intentions could you please show me Aquarius's person's intentions towards Aquarius we have a two of Pentacles we have a Queen of Pentacles and we have a three of Pentacles this person wants to they want to bring more stability to the situation and they want to show oh my gosh we have another ace we have three aces already we're just waiting for the ace of cups <laughs> big energy focusing this is this is about new beginning Aquarius they want to take a chance on you they want to start over this person their intention is to bring more stability into the situation three of pentacles they want to appear as a team player as someone who is willing to collaborate to, willing to um, compromise this person uh, they if in the past Aquarius experienced that sort of kind of very challenging behavior from this person's side 
th their intention is to present themselves completely differently. That they are willing to compromise, that they are willing to talk, that they are willing to work on the situation, that they are a team player, that, that it is like an um, um, effort, but not only from your side, but from, from their side as well, something of this kind. Two of Pentacles. At the moment, I feel this person wants to be, you know, they want to, they, they want to bring balance. They want to appear grounded. But overall, Aquarius, this person wants to bring stability. And I feel this person wants to balance things out with you as well. Ace of Pentacles, in their intentions, Aquarius, this person wants to offer you opportunity a new beginning again let's take a look Aquarius at your person's actions could you please show me Aquarius's person's actions towards Aquarius okay we have a page of Pentacles Five of Cups, and we have the Death card. So Aquarius, you might be um, dealing with Scorpio, and we have King of Swords. So another Aquarius is coming forward, Libra Gemini energy as well. This person wants to, wants to communicate with you, Aquarius. They have a lot to, they want to talk, they want to talk, they want to express some sort of truth here. They, they no longer want to be in this Five of Cups energy. I feel Aquarius that this person will communicate, you will have a quite uh, constructive conversation with them. And I feel that... Um, they will tell you that something happened in their life that essentially changed their life and they've changed and they've changed perspective it was like a major wake-up call for this person i feel uh, aquarius that uh, this person will tell you that something really kind of um, significant happened that brought um, energy of sadness and kind of force them to go within to take this step back in order to reevaluate their life and we have this death card here which which again shows a major transformation this person essentially will 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 explain it to you or will try to explain it to you and 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 tell you or confess to you that they've changed and, and they also will, I feel they will communicate that something changed in their life. That they experienced something and it completely changed them. And I don't feel that this particular situation is the happiest one. But I feel it's kind of um, in initiated that change within them that transformation that shift that is very much needed i also feel aquarius that this person will just um communicate that they've been missing you that they are unhappy without you and they no longer want to feel this way and i feel this person will ask is there a, is there a, is there a chance for both of us to reconcile to be together and to start over this is what I'm strongly getting here, Aquarius. Let's take a look at the outcome. Could you please show me outcome for Aquarius's connection with their person for the near future? It wouldn't surprise me, Aquarius, that this person was essentially said, I am lost without you. Look, you see? Okay, so we have, for the near future outcome, we have the hanged man. 
So Aquarius, for, for the immediate future or near future, I don't see a significant change with regards to your connection, okay? Because this is a very passive energy, the hanged man. You might be dealing with Pisces. Patience here is very important. And I feel also that this person is trying to look at the situation from a completely different perspective in order to not make the same mistake. Because I feel this person did you wrong. They were not particularly fair in the past. But it seems that something really significant happened in their life and, and they've changed perspective or that it really made them feel like on a, on a, on a serious level, essentially. However, for the near future, immediate future, I don't see a significant change with regards to your connection. This person might very well come forward and talk to you, but I feel Aquarius that um, Spirit is saying here that for at least, you know, like a week, let's say, because we're doing those readings weekly, um, for the near future and in the immediate, immediate future, with the hanged man, there is not, not much action. Okay, no, this, this is a very stagnant energy. So I feel that not much will change overall when it comes to your connection. However, it seems that this person really wants to talk. They really want to express what they've been through. And, and they, they are ready, I feel, to, um, to ask you if you want to give them another chance. Overall energy, Aquarius, uh, for your connection, for this reading, with regards to your connection with your person, is Page of Cups. So there is a potential. There is a potential for both of you to reconcile or to talk through, you know, uh, to have a conversation and talk about issues or the past. But there is a potential to make things happen for both of you. There is a potential for reconciliation and for the new beginning. But pages are potentials, okay? So there is this op opportunity. And Spirit is saying it only depends on both of you if you really want to, if you really want this. However, for, for, for now, as, a, as an outcome for your connection in a coming near future, I feel that things will stay as they are with the hanged man, okay? Thank you very much for being with me, Aquarius. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I truly hope that this reading was of help. I wish you all the very best, and once again, thank you so very much for being with me. I truly appreciate you. I truly, truly do. I truly appreciate you, Aquarius. Once again, thank you very much, and take care. Bye.